Many of you have a tough time deciding what kind of wine to pair with beef, red or white. Well, today we're here with the sommelier to discuss exactly how to do that. Here we are at Michael's in Santa Monica with Andrew. Thank you for having me. So if we're going to do a grilled steak, maybe summertime, barbecue, or maybe, you know, we do it broiled style, what would you pair with that? Well, with a simple grilled steak, I like a Bordeaux. Um, Bordeaux uh, tends to be Cabernet Franc, Cabernet Sauvignon, and Merlot. Mm -hmm. um, those are big red varietals that t stand up to the richness of the steak. They add layers of non-fruit flavors, kind of gravelly, um, earthiness to that. That's just going to go really well with the richness of the steak. Awesome. Okay, well, what if I was just going to make an easy cheeseburger? Uh, excellent. Just a simple, easy to go to wine for a burger. I like Spanish wines. Tempranillo is the most populous grape in, uh, in Spain. Um, there are a couple different areas you can look for. You can look for Ribera del Duero or Rioja, uh, even things like Toro, which is still a Tempranillo grape. Um, and it's going to have a little bit of acidity to the back end that's going to kind of kind of wash your palate after you've eaten your burger. Um, it's got a bright red cherry fruit. It's not crazy complex because you really want the flavors of the things you're having with the burger to kind of stand out, but it's going to pair really, really well. Awesome. All right. Well, finally, for those of us who make roast, you know, a wonderful wintertime classic, absolutely. what would you drink with a pot roast? No, uh, absolutely. Well, with a pot roast, you want a bigger, richer style of wine because there's all that sort of richness and fattiness to the to the pot roast that makes it so delicious. I tend to like things like Shiraz or California Syrah with something that's that big. Something it's got big, bold, black cherry and cassis kinds of flavors. It's got sort of uh, a little bit of pine or mint kind of notes to it that's really going to seem almost seasonal, that spiciness to a Shiraz. Thank you so much for your selections. You're certainly welcome. Thank you for having me. This video has been brought to you by Camus 2008 Cabernet Sauvignon.